Drones are becoming more a part of the modern battlefield, and the wars of the 21st century are being increasingly fought with the development of new tech rather than on the front line. This is why the RAF's Jackal drone is poised to be a game changer when it comes to military weaponry. This UAV has proven itself to do a significant task that other drones can't. This might be the difference between winning and losing a battle. Let's take a closer look at what that task was and what makes the Jackal so special. But before we get started, if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more just like it, remember to give us a like and subscribe to Military World to get more sent straight to your notifications. The Jackal is a small, lightweight, modular vertical takeoff and landing drone which is expected to fill a critical position in the future unmanned air force concept for advanced combat operations. The drone platform is the work of Flyby Technology, a UK startup, and brainchild of former RAF and Royal Navy fighter pilot John Parker. They worked with Turkish partners Fly BVLOS Technology, an aviation consultant, along with Maxwell Innovations, an aviation component manufacturer, to produce the drone. Research and development for the Jackal started at Drone Park in Gebze Technical University Technopark in Turkey at the start of 2022. The catalyst behind the need for such a vehicle was all courtesy of Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Once this began, the UK Royal Air Force's Rapid Capabilities Office contacted the UK-based drone experts Flyby to give them a brief on their new vehicle. In April of that year, the UAV successfully carried out its first demonstration flight for the Turkish Armed Forces in Ankara. This flight showed how the drone was able to stay in the air for 40 minutes during flight time. Fly BVLOS Technology then transferred the design and all other licenses for the Jackal to the UK around the same time. Further, Fly X Technology, a part of Fly BVLOS Technology, began working on a version of the vehicle at the request of the UK Ministry of Defense to make it battle ready. Flyby also collaborated with another company to discover the potential of firing its lightweight multi role missile from the Hackle as part of this development. The engineering team from Flyby and Thales worked together on a rapid six-week turnaround to build two Jackal drones, capable of firing the Thales lightweight multi-role missile. This had never been done before. This new iteration, dubbed Saiha, fired this missile in its first test firing in England towards the end of 2022. In further testing, the UAV successfully fired another Thales missile in a trial with the RAF in the spring of the following year. These tests proved the low recoil of the missiles, which meant that the drone could remain stable. This provides a much safer alternative to soldiers advancing with shoulder-fired weapons or crewed helicopters approaching enemy targets. The Jackal is a multi-purpose attack UAV, which can fire multiple missiles. Its wingspan of 16.4 feet, roughly 5 meters, can carry a significant weight of up to 33 pounds, or about 15 kilograms. It also has an impressive range of 81 miles or about 130 kilometers at a maximum altitude of 13,100 feet, which is roughly 4,000 meters. The drone's ability to launch and support missiles engineered by Thales makes it capable of firing modern weapons in flight to destroy enemy targets. This is its main feature, but another useful attribute is that it has a plug-and-play system that allows it to incorporate new equipment and technologies into the aircraft between missions. This makes the Jackal highly adaptable for battle. It can also be changed during continuous combat situations, which lets it comply with future regulatory guidelines and airworthiness standards. On top of this, the Jackal has top-spec technological features like beyond visual line of sight, sub-theater battle group level for tactical attacks, and multi-spectral sensors for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance operations. This makes the Jackal stealthy as well as lethal. This UAV can be integrated with Starstreak, a short-range surface-to-air missile, and LMM munitions as was proved during initial testing. It has an operational range of up to 93 miles, or 150 kilometers, on secure C2 links. The other way Flyby has made the Jackal stealthy is through the engineering of its engines and propulsion. It has four sets of twin contra-rotating propellers. This lets it take off, hover, and land vertically. 
During the testing phase, power for the two pairs of rotors and the electric ducted fans came from batteries, but production versions will instead use a turbo generator. These will be four wing-mounted electric ducted fan engines to move forward and maneuver at high speeds. The drone is capable of impressive speeds, a maximum of 99 miles per hour, or roughly 160 kilometers per hour, with a cruising speed of 67 miles per hour or 108 kilometers per hour. Another huge advantage of the Jackal is that it doesn't need a runway to get airborne. This is a massive plus when it comes to getting weapons into the sky quickly. Runways are typically weak during battle and act as an easy target. Instead, the Jackal is able to take off and land from hidden locations, like woods and urban areas. Also, another thing that the Jackal circumvents versus traditional vehicles is a long development time. Typically, it can take years for an aircraft to be designed and enter service, but with this drone, it went from nothing to firing two missiles in just six months. The modular design we mentioned earlier in the video is another massive advantage. This allows the UAV to be compatible with future equipment and weapons for the advanced battlefield. With military equipment developing at such a pace, this is a significant plus point for the drone. The modular capability also provides an option to increase the load carrying and range capacity with new iterations. The Jackal is small and lightweight against other aircraft, which makes it highly maneuverable. This means it can navigate in tight spaces, through narrow alleyways and fly at high speeds, making it ideal for all kinds of environments. Whilst all of this makes the Jackal an exciting prospect, what makes it so special is the fact it can be controlled autonomously. Advanced software and sensor technology allow it to navigate difficult spaces with no human interaction. This makes it an excellent asset for military reconnaissance and surveillance operations. And the main thing that will make this weapon more attractive to worldwide military forces is that it can provide affordable unmanned air combat capability to countries that ordinarily don't have resources for attack helicopters or fighter jets needed to survive on the modern battlefield. It's no surprise that this drone has attracted the attention of Ukraine, Iraq, and Taiwan. In fact, Taiwan has committed to a 160-unit launch order, which shows the potential of just how popular these vehicles may become in the future. According to Flyby, Jackal can imitate the capabilities of attack helicopters and fighter jets at a small percentage of the cost and with minimum risk. This represents a double-edged sword for Flyby's founder, and he's developed something truly groundbreaking, but something that threatens the future of his former profession fighter pilots. According to John Parker himself, the Jackal will let forces sit on the tops of trees and shoot from a distance without being detected, but crucially not compromising on speed. Parker has said that the beauty of the aircraft is it is as quick as a manned helicopter in flight. This means the Jackal can shoot in the hover position or on the move. It can chase a target and fire at the same time, and all of this without having to risk the life of a pilot. The Jackal team is now working on plans for full production while the aircraft undergoes further development. The Jackal represents the future of the battlefield. It's already proved capable of launching missiles completely remotely from altitude in landmark tests. This, along with its stealthy design and autonomous functionality, has understandably got the world watching. This project was born out of the Ukrainian conflict, but it's likely to be used all over the world for decades to come. Other defense firms are also developing drones, but the Jackal is believed to be the first of its kind to successfully complete RAF trials. Expect to see a lot more Jackals in the skies of the future. What are your thoughts on the Jackal? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give us a like and subscribe to Military World to get our latest videos straight to your notifications.